cannabis plant produces a, a variety of cannabinoids, and these are essentially lock and key chemicals that react with our endocannabinoid system. The THC cannabinoid is what everyone has known and loved for, for decades. Essentially, the difference is, is with the THC, we have a very strong um, psychoactive effect. And what, what CBD does, which is really special, is you're able to medicate and relieve symptoms of inflammation or pain or anxiety. Um, without having a psychoactive effect. There's research around the world currently to show CBD's incredible efficacy in, in a whole host of ailments, um, and everything from anti-anxiety, antidepressant, antipsychotic research. I think the potential of CBD is pretty much out of this world. It does target cannabinoid receptors in the brain, or if you attach medicines to that cannabinoid, you can deliver medicines to those synapses, and that's really good for people with dementia, Alzheimer's. And for those patients with chronic like pain, uh, arthritis, or, or epilepsy. And we also see with uh, veterans with PTSD. I'm a veteran of the United States Navy. I work with a lot of veterans uh, in Santa Cruz County and state that have post-traumatic stress. Post-traumatic stress is you know, one of the major issues and epidemics of suicide that are currently existing in the United States right now around veterans. And that speaks for anybody that's been inflicted with trauma. So it's not just veterans that have post-traumatic stress, anybody experiencing trauma. Typically, whenever somebody has this level of trauma, and they get prescribed anti-anxiety drugs, they get prescribed SSRI drugs, and oftentimes painkillers as well, like opiates. CBD is showing efficacy in, in, in eliminating the need for a lot of these other um, oftentimes more harmful psychoactive pharmaceutical drugs. And use these natural medicines, these cannabinoid medicines, to help people come off of severe opiate addictions. The intelligent application of CBD into, in dispensaries working with patients is to identify the wide variety of ailments that CBD is, is beneficial for, and then finding the right ratio of CBD to THC to help it. The potential, and as we continue to apply and look at CBD, it's gonna be uh, broadening its, its effects because it is so specific. If humans didn't evolve with cannabis, we wouldn't have cannabinoid receptors. And the plants did not evolve to us. We evolved because cannabis was in our lives, and we grew and evolved with cannabis.